Hi, my name is Drew Simpson. I'm auditioning for I Love You, You're Perfect, Now Change uh, for ACT. Pat? Stan? I'm so sorry I'm late. I got caught at the office. It's great to finally meet. Look, Stan, I don't mean to be rude, but I have been on an excruciating number of dates lately. And quite frankly, I'm a busy, busy, busy woman, and I just don't have the patience or the time for them anymore. But I had a great time chatting with you on AOL, and you pretty much look exactly like your picture. So let's say goodnight. Good night, and skip right on to our second date. Excuse me? <sighs> Stan, I don't have the time to repeat myself. Busy, busy, busy woman. I don't have the patience for the time. <laughs> oh, well, second date. Why not? Date? It would skip all that messy first date stuff. And you pretty much look like your picture too, so we're on to your second date. Poof. Pat, hi. Stan! So good to see you again. And went right on to the third date, where we both acted like we're going to have a pleasant time. Mm. But inside, we're getting ulcers trying to figure out if we're going to sleep with each other or not. Oh, yeah, the sexual tension part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll help rush things right along. But you know what, Stan? Busy, busy, busy. <laughs> so what do you say we just skip our first, second, and third date and just go right to the sex? Right to the sex. Right to the sex. Works for me. <laughs> Taxi. <laughs> oh, but wait. First time sex, do the lights stay on? Oh. Do the lights go off? Will, you, will I satisfy you? Am I even going to... Get it up? Ouch. So what do you say we skip the two, skip the sets and go right to the morning after where we're both trying to figure out how to get out of what we did the night before? Yeah, yeah. But you know what, Stan? My schedule is really tight. <laughs> I just don't have the time to make up all the reasons I'll need to convince myself to go out with you. So what do we say we've been dating for two months? And uh, this would be the part where I'd start getting really interested in you and then you'd start inexplicably backing away. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm. Or we can go right to where you ask me if this dress makes you look fat oh. and I don't answer quickly enough. And then you don't speak to me for three days. Yeah, possibly. Or you could go to that part where you tell me that you want to start dating other women, but then I give you an ultimatum, and then you leave me. And then an hour later, you come whippering back like a little dog. <laughs> yeah, I always like that part. Yeah, me too. Oh, but this is all so time-consuming. So what do you say we just jump right into our first argument? Our first argument? Yep. So, you mean that you want to skip all the positive parts of our relationship and just go right to our first fight? Be a major time saver. Huh. You prick! Bitch. Bastard! Ball buster. Okay. okay. <laughs> hmm. Now let's... Wait. I got it. I got it. I got it. Tell me. Tell You're me. gonna love this. Let's go to after we've been broken up for about a year. Oh, and we bittersweetly bump into each other one cold. A foggy. Miserable night in front of a Starbucks. Starbucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, and, and you have a date and I don't. Of course. You first. You first. S Pat? Stan? Hi. You look great. Pilates. <laughs> oh, this is tomorrow. Hi. We're off to see the impressionist at the Met. I've always loved the Met. So let's get together sometime. <gasps> yeah. Stan, we had some good times together, didn't we? We had it all. We had it all. Thank you so much.